conference play is finally here across the board in the Pac-12 South as Utah visits Arizona on Friday night, 7.30 Pacific on FS1. And for the Utah Utes, Tyler Huntley shocked everybody when he won the job at the quarterback position. But right now, he's playing like one of the top five quarterbacks in this entire conference, and I think he's a special player. In fact, Darren Carrington said he reminds him of Marcus Mariota. How about that as a comparison for this young signal car? But I love it when you dive into the staff of this young man. According to PFF College, he's the third most accurate passer in the Pac-12. And the stat that really lights me up is he's got the third best completion percentage on play action passes. That means this young man is a traditional threat in a variety of different areas in this football game, and it's going to have to be with this explosive offense if Utah wants to take a run at the Pac-12 South title. Now on defense, it's going to be really fun to watch because Brandon Dawson gets the ball out faster than any quarterback in the Pac-12 conference, and he's going to have to be extremely efficient because I think he's going up against the best defense in the entire Pac-12 right now. When I look at Kylie Fitz at the defensive end, Bradley and I at the defensive end, this back end, this secondary, they fly around and they are disciplined. Only 14 missed tackles on the entire season. That is the lowest number in the entire Pac-12 conference. So this is a very disciplined team under Kyle Whittingham. Now Arizona has had Utah's number. They've won four of the last five in this matchup. So it will be an interesting one. It'll be lit on Friday night in the desert. We all know what Richard can do, creating some sort of magic. But overall, I think right now the Utah Utes, they're playing the best collective football in all three phases among all the teams in the Pac-12 South. Tune into this one, 7.30 Pacific, Friday night on FS1 as Utah visits Arizona.